Hi, I'm Howard and this is Crazy Tech and it's January 13th, 2020 and I'm going to do an update on the radiation test that I did on our water in Detroit after we found out that there was a radiation spill from a company that helped build the atomic bomb which is in the spill was in Detroit River. I have this aware electronics radiation meter and I was checking the carbon filter under my sink because carbon will store radioactivity. In this case it was uranium rods. The radiation spill happened on November 26, 2019 and it was reported by the Free Press on December 6, 2019. If there was any radioactivity that escaped I would be able to detect it in my carbon filter. I use this radiation meter to check for radiation and I did that on December 7th and I really didn't find any radiation in our water but right now I'm going to check it again. These are my two filters. One is a ceramic filter which removes bacteria. The other one is a KDF GAC. The KDF removes chlorine and heavy metals and copper and arsenic and it also has carbon granules in it and the carbon would absorb radioactivity so on December 7th I did a check and I'm going to do it again right now let's see now there is background radioactivity and that's always present and there's where the carbon filter is. If the Geiger counter clicked m more frequently than just background radiation, which is one every five seconds or three seconds or two, one or two, if it clicked like 10, 10 per second or something like that, that would mean the carbon filter is absorbing the radioactivity and it's in the carbon in, in the cartridge. But I didn't find anything, so anyhow, we're safe here in Detroit. If you like this crazy tech, please subscribe. The subscribe button is on the right side of the screen, and I'll be back with more. Thanks.